And we're back at the Big Red Barn. This is video six, our final video for the winter antique show from Round Top, Texas. Again, the Big Red Barn. If there's anything you'd like to buy, please email me at franzwig at cox.net or text me. If you know anyone that wants to sell a collection or sell any rare pieces, please contact me. And also, if you would like... Um, emailed photos which you can enlarge or you have any questions please email me and our last video picks up with hard to find set of 12 water goblets in jubilee um there are great blanks nicely cut deep um mitered star bases they're signed, and the whole set of 12 is $7.95. It's very difficult to find 12 that have stayed together. And then here's a green cut to clear, champagne stems. Um, I've heard different thoughts on these, whether it's possibly being Moser or Baccarat. Um, regardless, they're really nice, and cut, color cut to clear is hard to find. So there's 10 of these, and they are $8.95, excellent quality. So a two-handle um, cabaret, um, I think it's nine inches in diameter and 12 inches wide at the handles. The handles are punzi cut. There is a tooth missing off the rim that I hadn't seen, so I'm only asking $75 for that. In the back here we have um, a Steuben optic style vase. It's five rounded lobes. It's signed with the fleur-de-lis signature six inches tall five inches in diameter it's only 99 dollars there's a fat stubby harbor design shoulder vase it's cut from top to bottom a uh, really unique piece it's only 3.95 haven't had one of these in a while a nicely done chalice vase 12 inches tall hop star base nice detailed cutting and it is 4.50 there's a beautiful green cut to clear, tall champagne pitcher. It's cut in flutes, nice, almost, not really an olive green, but closer to an emerald green. Um, elegant shape. I was pricing this at $11.95 until I saw the bubble. There's a open bubble in the... There, there it is. And it's a stretched bubble that was blown in the blank, but it was sold that way. It couldn't have been done later. So anyway, I'm only asking $275 for that. There's a small sterling topped hair receiver. It's two and a half inches in diameter and two and a quarter inches tall. And it's only $45. Always one of my favorites is this Bellevue pattern by Taylor Brothers. Um, just cut from end to end. Great circular hop star clusters this one's eight inches in diameter and it's 13.95 and there's another one of those um, five inch clark slash maple city plates it's only 35 dollars here's a nice punch bowl set and it's 12 inches in diameter there are eight cups i had six but i found two more it actually has the matching ladle. Um, it's very rare to have the ex exact pattern cut in the ladle. Punch bowl is 14 inches in diameter. Uh, two part, and it is 32.50. Have a 12 inch tall uh, corset vase by Dorflinger cut in hollow diamond always very popular for collectors it's five inches diameter and 14.95 very rare green cut to clear jewel by clark trumpet vase it's seven and a quarter inches tall beautiful color hop star cut base it is 11.75 cobalt cut to clear decanter i want to say this is new england or sandwich glass Beautiful, beautiful color. Has a little wafer base. Um, cut all in diamonds and fans. And it's $21.95. Huge 16-inch tall bowling pin vase. 
in the Ogaunts pattern by Drake. It's shown on page 200 of the Revy book, and it is 2850. The thing weighs a ton. The blank is so thick, and it's very deeply cut. Great quality. Here's a stunning emerald green to clear salad bowl. It is 10 inches in diameter, and it is 4 and 3 quarter inches tall. And the cutting is really well done on this brilliant blank. It is $31.95, but this is a great piece of color. Just stunning quality. Cute little pickle tray, oval shape, has a German cross center, $35. A footed bud vase, I guess you would call it, or cylinder vase. It's in the Navarre pattern by Hawks, and it's only $345. It's a nice quality nine inch diameter deep bowl. Don't know who did it, but again, this had to be done by a major company. The blank is superb. The cutting is very, very well done. Unique design. I love the crossing bars cane center. And it's only $275. That's a really good buy. Here's a rarity. It's Acorn Pattern by William Anderson. It's shown in the Chain of Evidence book. Um, very uh, silvery effect with the way the cutting is done. One of Anderson's magical traits. The acorns are really cool. Uh, nine inch diameter, and that is $8.95. That's probably the only one I've ever owned, actually. I have one of those rare bread trays by Meriden. It's in the Alhambra pattern. It's the only shape that has the extra hob stars cut on the ends outside of the Greek key, but that's shown in their catalog. Uh, shown in Pearson on page 149, volume 1. $27.95. That's only the second I think I've ever owned. And then it's a beautiful Hawks, um, Hawk wine, solid green bowl, clear stem and starburst base. Seven inches tall, it's $175. There's a cranberry cut to clear, um, tall Hawk wine, flute cut at the top, flute cut stem with a teardrop faceted knob and a star base and it is 125 great rainbow pattern small vase these are so hard to find it's um, blue orange and yellow I think it's very cute it's 895 and then a little cradle bowl seven and three quarter inches long 125 Cobalt cut to clear tall wine. It's eight inches tall and it is 125. It's probably Val St. Lambert, but the cobalt is just really radiant. Here's a little turquoise liqueur, extremely rare color, four and a half inches tall, and it's 75. It's the only one I have. Square shaped hawk's bowl. There's a rim chip on one of the teeth. And it is nine inches wide and I think ten on the diagonal. It's only forty dollars. And uh, the Hope cut glass string holder. These are hard to find. Circa eighteen ninety nine. Gorham sterling top, and it's only four seventy five. Thank you.